A little Perth boy is losing his eyesight after an accident at a Perth water park four months ago. Mason McDonald suffered a fractured skull after falling from a slide at Outback Splash in Bullsbrook. Doctors don't know if his brain injury is going to get worse. I feel angry now um, and I look at what Mason's still dealing with um, and just feel totally gutted to be honest. I'm not really sure where to turn. And for more on this, we're joined by KidSafe CEO Scott Phillips this morning. Good morning to you, Scott. What does this accident say morning, about Jim. the general level of safety at water parks? I think what it's telling us is that as we have this explosion of new um, family parks like water parks and trampoline um, parks, that we may be seeing things get um, rushed out um, and then maybe the safety aspect, particularly of our little ones, isn't being considered right from the beginning. And the regulations that are currently there, are they sufficient in your view? Currently we have um, non-mandatory playground um, regulations around equipment and that's really about the equipment that we see in local parks. But we have schools and local government using those regulations for best practice. Um, we do need to see some regulations particularly around water parks and trampoline parks at this point. So parents who take their kids uh, to these water parks and, and particularly go on water slides, not just at Outback Splash but other similar venues, can they feel confident that the regulations are in place that are going to ensure minimal risk to them and their children? Well, we know the regulations aren't in place, but um, I think that we have to not um, measure everybody the same. But any time I'd be entering a park like that, I'd be making sure that I'm looking at the safety information and talking to the staff there. And really, if something doesn't look safe, don't use it. We're, f we're finding in some places that um, the fall spaces where people can fall, there's not enough soft fall underneath um, and there's no consideration for if somebody did fall off something. And in this case, we saw something tragic happen when that happened. And just lastly, Scott, uh, any advice you'd give to parents or kids to maximise their safety just at again. these sorts of water parks? Yeah, just, just again, um, Let's never consider that somebody else has checked everything for us. I think sometimes we fall into the trap when we walk into this place. If it, place, if it doesn't look right, um, I wouldn't let my children on it. And just try not to mix bigger kids with smaller kids because quite often that can lead to um, these accidents happening. All right, Scott, thank you for your time this morning.